welcome to Podgorica. Um, I am here in the capital of Montenegro. I thought there was not gonna be anything to see, but the river looks amazing. I wanna go see it. Um, and it turns out they have a mosque and halal restaurant, well, a few halal restaurants. And I'm really excited. And then they have the clock tower that they call the Sat something. So this video is going to be about Podgorica, like try and encapsulate everything in the super tiny amount of time that I have here. Here's the clock tower. And here is the promised restaurant. Pod Volat. Pod Volat apparently has halal food. Okay, the waiter confirmed that the meat is halal. I cannot describe how good this food is. This is my little room in the hotel next to the bus station. I think it's a really convenient location. It's 7 in the morning and I think I'm just by myself here at the breakfast. So I get dips on everything. Like this is the hotel. This is the bus station. This is how close it is. Let's start the morning with the church. It's the point right before the hill starts. Ooh, pretty. We can do it in two kilometers or one kilometer. So since I have no idea what I'm doing, I'll just go and walk and see how long it takes me. It's fantastic to start the morning. A lot of the locals seem to use this uh, forest slash park to work out in pairs with matching trainsuits. Um, and just like walking, a lot of people are walking their dogs, it's just really, really cool. And I'm gonna try and go all the way to the top to see the whole view of the city. I actually have no idea where the panoramic view is. I asked, somebody told me like that way. So I walked up an hour and it's kind of the same, like it doesn't incline or decline massively. So it's gonna be, I'm assuming the same speed going down as well. You guys look, I reached a panoramic view. You can see it a little better, but yeah, that's the top of the bridge, the stadium and the foresty park okay the street is down there so but obviously I had to make it difficult for myself and not follow the correct trail like Estra how are you even gonna like go down like this they're not even proper steps okay let's do a mini jump of course there's a mini jump oh my gosh it is the right way down and I've just came down in like 10 minutes Exploring the park has been so much fun. I really liked it. I wish I had more time to go properly to the top. Let's go see the mosque, maybe the, like another church if we have time. The bridge, and then I head back to the airport. I'm here and I need to go where the star is. This is where the mosque is. You guys seen it let's take a photo i'm here by the bridge and if i walk straight i'll reach to the mosque it's just so nice to walk in the green how stunning is this
picture across the river, I can see the minaret of the mosque. mosque the fence has a little crescent the skender shawush mosque I'll show you quickly it's quite simple there is space for the ladies upstairs but it's really nice look at the old graves Ooh, this is from the 13th century mosque I visited behind me and it was such a nice mosque now I'm headed to the, another older mosque than this one and it's quite exciting to see different people here so it's five minutes from here to go to the other mosque and hopefully I'll go there very quickly and then go catch my taxi to the airport more details I love the chandelier it's just so simple and beautiful the grandsons of the Prophet Hassan and Hussein then this is Bilal al Habashi he's the one who used to recall the call for prayer during the Prophet time Stunning! <laughs> <laughs> 